She was getting ready for a normal day at her barber shop, but things quickly turned when she was robbed while opening. It's been less than a week since that happened. Now, the business owner in Thomasboro is already preparing in case it ever happens again. WCI 3's Jared Farmers in the newsroom tonight. Jared, what steps is she taking? Paul, she installed a new camera to watch who's outside of her front door as well as lights. She's trying to better protect herself and her business. It's just so hard to describe um, the feeling. It's, I've never been so scared or terrified my whole entire life. Jody Johnson opens her shop at 5 in the morning. It makes it hard to see people coming in. Anybody can see in, but I can't see out. She says on Friday she was waiting at the front desk for her first customers like normal. But then... When two people did come in, they were not customers. It was the robbers. She says they told her they had a gun. If I give him the money, then nothing worse will happen. The robbers left just nine minutes before police could arrive. She says the whole experience was terrifying, but she also says she feels overwhelmed by all the community support since the attack. They're not customers, they're my friends, and I, I am just, I haven't even finished replying back to all the text and the phone calls and the emails that I've gotten from people. The county sheriff's office is still investigating. If you have any tips that might help lead to an arrest, they say to give them a call. Live in the newsroom, I'm Jared Farmer, WCIA 3, your local news leader. Jared, thanks for that update.